All right, so we'll start off with a real simple question. Uh, first and last name, class year, and position you play. Um, I'm Melina Pimentel. I'm a senior, class of 2018, and I play point guard. Melina, well, just talk about the past week, you know, three big wins for you guys. Uh, just talk about how the season's going as well as also that past week. Um, in the past week, the three games have been challenging, but we came through and really showed our improvement as a team. Um, this year is definitely our best year so far. We've won five games, which is more than last year already, and we're trying to make it to the tournament. Talk about what's made this year this so much fun again as a senior. Um, definitely our new coaching staff, they're more involved. Um, we feel like we can really go to them with anything. And we're just more, there's more team chemistry, I guess. Well, um, what, from your perspective here too, I mean, you know, with looking kind of looking ahead, how is this the past week going to kind of use you guys? As, it's going to help you guys going forward. Um, I mean, you guys are right now in a position where a couple more wins, you guys will be able to qualify for the tournament. Um, it's definitely a confidence booster. I feel like our morale overall is definitely at an all-time high. And... We're on a roll, basically, so if we win a few more games, I think we're definitely going to be on the way to the tournament. Uh, just talk about growing up in Somerville playing basketball. It's a city that's obviously known for basketball. Just kind of how did you get, into the, get involved with the game? Parents, friends, family, siblings? Um, I started playing basketball in sixth grade. I heard about it through um, Somerville Recreation, and Somerville is definitely the place to play basketball because um, they start you off at a young age and like really care about you, and then... Throughout the years, you just grow with the people you play with. Like my two other um, co-captains, we've been playing together since I was like 12. So it's definitely a um, community. From your perspective, uh, is there a player that you've watched growing up that you try to mimic You know, in your game? Um, definitely um, the JV coach, Indira Vora. She's, um, I watched her since I was like really little. So she's definitely someone that I want to like it's good to have her on the coaching staff because then I can, she can like help me during practice and stuff. Yeah. And from her perspective, from your perspective with her, your relationship you've built, how has she been able to make you a better player? You think? Um, <clears throat> whenever I'm having like an off game or something, she always sits me down and talks to me. Um, she really knows how to like get my get me out of my own head when I can't do it myself. And she just she believes in all of us, and it's, it really helps us. All right, a few quick fun questions here too. Um, go to game food. What's, what's the game? You know, the food you eat on the game day to kind of get you in the right, right mood, the right, right set. Obviously, you got a go to drink, go to food that's get you ready to go. Definitely, I eat a banana before every game, and I drink like half a Gatorade at least. Uh, you got like one or two songs that you're listening to on your uh, through your phone, or obviously iPod, iPod that you're listening to. I would um, say iPod, but obviously right now everyone's listening to Spotify on their phones. So just kind of talk about, yeah. Um, motorsport and. There's another song, but um, I can't think of the name right now. And then I was just say kind of, uh, do you got a favorite basketball movie? Just to round out the subject, cap it off here. Love and basketball. Love and basketball, awesome. All right, thanks so much for the time.